Hello there beautiful people, welcome to my YouTube channel. For this tutorial we're going to learn how to make this bikini top. Grab a pen and paper and write down the material you will need. I'm using my own bikini pattern, the link is below. You need band piece pattern, front and strap guard piece pattern. You need swim elastic lining, swimwear fabric, roti cutter, scissors, polyester thread and some pin. Now let's get started. Place the front piece on swimwear fabric, cut two, and do the same on swimwear lining. Place your fabric on fold and cut to one band piece. Use the pattern piece stripe guide to cut two pieces. To make my life easier, I always cut two layers of fabric for the stripes, but you can always cut one by one. But just remember you need two stripes. You need to cut two elastic at the same measurement as the stripes. After you finish cutting your elastic, you should have two front pieces for the fabric and lining, one band, one stripes, and two elastic. Fold and pin the stripe double lengthwise, right side together and sew using a 6mm seam allowance. I am using an overlock, but if you don't have it, you can use a sewing machine using a zigzag stitch. Place the elastic under the stripes seam allowance row edge and sew the elastic 6mm seam allowance. Turn the stripe right side out. I'm using a loop toner, but if you don't have one, use a safety pin. Pull the stripe throughout and tie a knot at the end. I put those pins so you guys can see where's the right side together. This is the right side and this is the right side as well for the other piece. So now we need to attach the stripes on the bra piece. So if you place like this, just right here. which is the top side of the pattern. If 
we just place the stripes here about one centimeters you can pin the stripes here one you have to pin the stripes on the top of the bikini on the right side together okay now we're going to do a blast test just around here around here Make sure you backstage. So see, it's just a tiny stitch. And we can I do the same thing for the other one. here you don't need to use a zigzag you can just use a normal straight stitch we have to place the lining with the fabric right side together so this is the wrong side if you guys can see I have like a little mark just to remind me this is the inside of the lining or wrong side of the lining so now if you place your lining right side lining right side bikini bra just place like this and we're going to pin around so now we need to stitch around here make sure your stripes is not attached to the swimwear or to the lining Grab your bra piece and sew lower edge between notch using a straight stitch about one centimeter. We need to make a gathered around here.
To make a goddess, pull the thread at the end slowly. Basically, we just wanted the gutter to be here. So this is the button. So if you see, this is the notch. And this is the notch. So we wanted the gutter to be around here. Okay. Make sure at least both cup, both bras is on the same length and the gut is all distributed evenly. Overlap and pin the right bra piece to the left bra piece. Make sure the knots are aligned together. Bust using a wide straight stitch. Now you need your band. With the right side together, fold the band in half and pin. Sew so one and a half seam allowance. With wrong side together, fold the band in half and sew row edge together around one centimeter. Pin upper edge of the band to the lower edge bra. Make sure centers and knots are aligned. Adjust the garden between the notch and stretch the band if it's needed to fit between notch. So around one and a half seam allowance. Well done, you're almost done. All you have to do is stop stitching. 
using a zigzag.